Good afternoon. My name is Tavia Danch and I am the Community Outreach Manager at Colorado State University Global. I am pleased to welcome you to CSU Global's College and Career Success Webinar Series. During this webinar, we will be sharing information on the benefits you're entitled to as one of our partners, how your employees can take advantage of a tuition discount toward degree programs and certifications, and various opportunities you can pursue within our partnership that will increase the number of benefits you're afforded. But first, I wanted to share a little about CSU Global. CSU Global was created by the Colorado State University System in 2007 as the first independent 100% online state university in the US. We have over a decade of leadership in providing quality online education for working adults. As a state nonprofit institution, CSU Global's focus is workplace success through higher education. And we're so happy that you're here to learn more. Before we get started, I wanted to remind you all of a few things. First, at the bottom of your screen, you will see a Q&A button. At any time during the presentation, please go ahead and submit any questions you might have there, and we'll answer as many of those as possible during the Q&A section at the end. Next, you'll also see a chat button there. Please feel free to introduce yourself, tell us what you hope to learn today, and where you are joining from today. Just remember to select all participants and attendees in the dropdown. And finally, after the webinar, we'll send you each a copy of the recording and a short survey for you to fill out so we can continue to improve and provide you with valuable information. I would now like to introduce you to Travis Sufel, Senior Director of Engagement, and Stan Kropak, Engagement Operations Manager at CSU Global. With that, I'll turn the time over to Travis and Stan. All right, thank you very much, Tavia, and welcome to everybody who's in uh, attendance today. I know we have some folks who already are employed with some of our current partner organizations, and I believe some who are not yet partnered with us. So we'll have more information about how to become an employer partner as well, uh, and we'll spend some time today talking about some of the benefits of partnership for your organization and for your employees. The primary reason that CSU Global offers partnerships like this is because we have a unique position uh, to upskill employees with our degree programs and certificate programs that are highly career relevant. Uh, that is really the primary purpose for us to offer this type of uh, benefit for employers. Uh, and the benefit for those employees is that they will receive a discounted tuition rate. The benefit for you as an employer is that you have a higher likelihood to retain your employees. Uh, in fact, LinkedIn did a survey of workforce learning in 2018, and they reported that 93% of employees said they would stay longer at a company if that company participated and invested in their career development. Uh, so that's a really overwhelming percent. 93% of employees who were surveyed said that if their employer invested in their development, they'd be much more likely to stay with that particular organization. Uh, and we know at CSU Global from speaking with a lot of employers uh, and that includes government agencies, large corporations, and small businesses, that uh, employers are really looking for critical thinking skills in their employees uh, and the ability to learn new tasks. Uh, the workforce today is very highly dynamic and tech-driven, and so it's really important that our uh, employees and successful folks in the workforce are able to keep up with those particular demands. Um, so as Tavia mentioned, we have over 2,000 partners that we work with in a variety of ways, and I'm gonna get to that on the next slide. Uh, at the very basic level, we offer a discounted tuition rate for employees of our affiliate partners. And that is a 10% tuition discount on our already low tuition rates. So at the undergraduate level, we offer a $350 rate for everyone, and it's reduced to $315 for our employer partner students. 
and for our graduate tuition rate is $500 at the standard rate and $450 at our reduced rate for affiliate partners. Uh, so it's a, a nice benefit for employees of those organizations to be able to receive that discounted tuition rate. In addition, uh, we are more than happy to advertise the relationship that we have with your organization, either by doing a webinar like the one you're participating in today, uh, or conducting a lunch and learn session, or really we're open to a lot of opportunities um, for deeper partnership, which we'll talk about in just a moment. Um, those webinars, we can do something specific to CSU Global as an information session for employees to learn more about us, but we can also do them on more broad topics. So we're happy to talk about management and human resources best practices uh, or other things that would be beneficial to your employees at large. Uh, and those are a couple of the ways that we can advertise our partnership and help get the word out to any students who might be uh, interested, employee students who might be interested in CSU Global. Uh, now, one of the things I did mention is our ability to offer a deeper level of partnership. And there are quite a few different ways that we can do this. And really for us, the sky is the limit. So we are interested in learning from our employer partners how we can best serve them uh, and support the employees who are students in becoming upskilled and contributing back to the workforce. Uh, one of the ways that we're able to offer a deeper level of partnership is by providing credit for on-the-job training. And this is a really great opportunity for an employee to earn college credit for training that they have completed on the job uh, at their company. So when I turn it over to Stan here in just a moment, he's going to give some real world examples of the work we've done in this area. Um, but we can, we can do these reviews relatively easily. Uh, we need to see the training that's conducted and the learning outcomes associated with that training, how that learning outcome is assessed, and then some of the credentials of the people conducting the training. Uh, and it's an opportunity that folks can earn college credit for training they're already doing as part of their work. So that's one thing that we're really excited to be able to offer. Uh, additionally, we are able to develop custom curriculum for employers uh, where they have a specific need that isn't otherwise met. So we have some employer partners who have asked us to put together specific curriculum. Uh, that might mean a certificate program where we put courses together that don't already fit together in one of our certificate or degree programs. It can also mean that we develop something custom. So a leadership development training that's specific to a certain government agency, for example. Uh, we have the opportunity to talk through some of those those can be done for credit, so they could earn college credit while completing that. It also can be done um, without college credit. We do give our employer partners the opportunity to post their jobs in our CSU Global Connect, which is a place where our students can go to connect with each other and also to see available job postings and other opportunities to help prepare them for their future careers. Um, so that's one exciting opportunity for an employer that benefits the employer and then benefits our, our total student body here at CSU Global. Uh, and then we also have opportunities for internship, practicum, and apprenticeship. So within our degree programs, students have the option to complete an internship or a practicum where they are getting real world experience, perhaps in a new career field, and also reflecting on that experience to earn college credit. So we have those opportunities available and we can certainly help set up an employer 
with an intern uh, in order to help do some of the duties around the office while earning college credit. Uh, one of the final ways that we offer deeper partnership is through participation in our program advisory board. So every year or 18 months, depending on the degree program, our programs are reevaluated and redeveloped in order to make sure we're teaching the most current and relevant information to our students. And one of the ways we ensure that we're being career relevant is by including employers in the discussion about what's included in the curriculum. So we invite our affiliate partners to join those conversations. Um, we have degree programs in management, leadership, healthcare, human resources, information technology, and criminology, just to name a few. And so we want our affiliate partners who have that industry specific knowledge to help inform some of the uh, learning that we're offering for our students. Uh, so I'm gonna turn it over to Stan. He's gonna give some of the specific examples of where we've done these deeper partnerships in the past, and then also give you all some information about how you can do some of these deeper partnerships if this is something you're interested in within your organization. Uh, thank you so much, Travis, for that uh, segue. Um, would like to give everybody here uh, a couple examples of some of the deeper level partnerships that we have established. Um, the first one being uh, Hazelden Construction. Now, uh, Hazelden Construction, we have reviewed their training uh, for credit. So essentially, uh, Hazelden asked us to review some of the um, training that their employees have already been going through. And we were able to take a look at specific training such as OSHA training, um, accounting principles for project managers, uh, scheduling software that the construction workers use, um, just to give you a couple of the examples of the types of courses that we took a look at. And essentially, uh, we were able to articulate eight total credits from the training that Hazleton employees already took. So essentially, just by doing the work within their own organization, Hazelden employees already have eight credits completed uh, at CSU Global. And these are going to be elective credits at the undergraduate level. And another really wonderful uh, piece of this partnership with Hazelden Construction is that Hazelden set up a scholarship program for their employees to take advantage of. And essentially their employees can apply for this scholarship, which they can then apply at CSU Global. And the beauty of it is as a part of our deeper partnership, we actually have a direct billing option set up for Hazelden. That way, once their employees do uh, receive that scholarship funding, uh, we can bill Hazelden directly and the students don't have to come out of pocket for those tuition costs. Um, so that's actually a really nice way to um, sort of create a financial partnership as well. Um, finally, uh, what we do so oftentimes, as we did with Hazelden Construction, is we do feature our partners in our statewide uh, university system magazine. So there is a great deal of back and forth promotion between us and Hazelden Construction. And viewership ranges from uh, not just Colorado, but certainly um, all over the United States and beyond. So with Hazelden, we had the articulation of credits, the direct billing, as well as the marketing promotion on both sides. And that's been going really quite well. Uh, the next example I'd like to share with you is DeVita. Uh, DeVita is one of the largest um, dialysis and blood work companies in the United States. And we actually also did a credit articulation with DeVita. Now, our uh, faculty board members um, and our uh, top academic leaders took a look at their training. Uh, for example, DeVita employees who went through dialysis treatment training, dialysis technician training, uh, data collection training, uh, we took a look at all of those types of trainings and we found that we could bring in 21 total credits from the work that those employees had 
already done um, as they have been working with the Vita. So a undergraduate degree at CSU Global is 120 total credits. So for all intents and purposes, Davida employees have one sixth of their degree already completed before they even matriculate into the university. It's a really nice foot in the door uh, for people who are looking to complete their degree or um, to get ahead and get that much closer to graduation. The next example I'd like to share with you is another healthcare example. It's the Hospital Corporation of America. And the Hospital Corporation is uh, an umbrella that has 174 hospitals uh, under them. And essentially, we were able to extend a discount to all of the employees that belong to all of those hospitals. And what's really interesting there is we were actually able to give them a steeper discount than our standard partner discount because of the volume of employees that they have at Hospital Corporation of America. So those students are enjoying a deeper discount. Finally, I'd like to bring up Chipotle, another one of our deeper partners. And with Chipotle, we did a credit articulation, again, meaning we just took a look at the credits, excuse me, the training that Chipotle employees were going through. We assessed them and we assessed some of the training such as uh, their kitchen manager training, their service manager training, their apprentice training, and crew training. So if somebody from Chipotle was to go through all those trainings, we would be able to award 44 total credits, which is just over a third of a degree. Um, now these are just massive cost savings benefits for those employees as they come into our university. Um, they're able to really have a large chunk of their elective credits completed uh, for their undergraduate program of choice. So these are just some of the many examples that we wanted to share with you today to give you an, some insights as to how some of these benefits are partnering, uh, excuse me, how these, some of these benefits are um, uh, benefiting our, uh, our partners. So let's go on to the next slide, please. So the purpose of this webinar was to really give you uh, those insights as to what your benefits are and how you can leverage those benefits either at the base level or at a deeper level. Now, um, we also want to make you aware that um, we do offer updates and newsletters about our new programs. We do also offer uh, ways for you to engage with the university through uh, uh, marketing, reciprocal communications, and uh, we also wanted to give you an overview of how you can become a partner or if you already are a partner, how you can reach out to us um, with inquiries about how to set up a webinar specifically about maybe a specific program you're interested in or as Travis mentioned, a general uh, question and answer session where we can um, keep your employees um, apprised of um, some, some of the benefits that they're entitled to. So uh, if you would please go on to the uh, next slide. Um, so you can always reach out to us at outreach at csuglobal.edu, whether you are a prospective new partner or if you are a current partner. And essentially that will reach my inbox. That's outreach at csuglobal.edu. And we can begin a conversation about what your needs are. We can assess those needs and see what kind of solutions we can come up for you. Again, it can be at the very base level of just offering that 10% discount, or it could be at that deeper level partnership where we have discussed credit articulation, job boards, et cetera, some of the things that Travis mentioned. So uh, I would like to just open up the floor uh, for any questions that you might have uh, about the material that we've covered, anything about the university generally, or um, any um, details that we can elaborate on.
Wonderful. Thank you so much, Stan and Travis. This was really great. And now we, as Stan mentioned, we're going to head into the Q&A session. Uh, so as a reminder, to submit a question, please click on the Q&A button at the bottom of your Zoom screen and type in your question. And we'll get to as many of those as we can. Uh, so we're going to start off with the first question. My organization is small. Is there a minimum employee count required in order to be eligible to become a partner with CSU Global? I'll take that one. Um, we currently have no limitations on how big or small a company has to be to become our partner. Um, we value small businesses the same way that we value large multinational corporations. You know, if you have a small business and you have one student who would like to attend our university, we will gladly um, set up a partnership with you and extend the discount to that student. So. Uh, big or small, um, well, we you know, don't discriminate on size. Wonderful. Thank you. Next question. Can students combine the employer benefits and scholarships to pay for their tuition? Yes, they can. So the 10% tuition discount uh, is offered for employee students. And then we have a wide variety of scholarships offered both internally at CSU Global and also externally. Uh, so certainly you can use scholarships. Many organizations, of course, offer employer reimbursement and that can also be used to um, supplement your tuition. And one thing I like to mention when we talk about employer reimbursement at CSU Global, we do have a tuition deferment agreement which allows you to defer payment of your tuition for 30 days after your grade post so that you're not having to cover the cost of tuition upfront. If your employer will reimburse, we will actually wait until those grades are there and give your employer time to pay after the grade is posted. But yes, also scholarships to answer the question. Wonderful, thank you. Next question, does CSU Global provide brochures or some type of informational sheet to employer partners for them to distribute to interested employees? Yes, I'll take that one. Um, so I oversee the onboarding of all of our new partners and the relationships that we have. And essentially, as soon as all of the documentation is processed, I send out what's called an affiliate partner welcome kit to every new partner that we bring on. And this kit basically has PDF attachments that um, uh, employers are welcome to distribute to all of their employees. Um, there's information about the university, about the programs, about the discounts that they're entitled to, recent rankings, as well as other relevant information. Now, let's say your organization specifically is interested in a Bachelor of Science degree in computer science, you just let me know and I will include any specific information about that program that you want. So I very often customize those welcome kits to include specific programmatic information depending on what the needs are of the organization. And I'm able to send you that information, not just at the start, but at any point that you request it. So um, if you have questions, about a specific program or admissions requirements for your employees or anything like that, um, you will get that information up front. And then, of course, at any given point in our relationship, you're welcome to reach out directly to me. Um, and I will be glad to relay any relevant documentation your way. Thank you. How many employees were associated with Hospital Corporation of America? And how large is the actual organization as a whole? Yeah, so there are 148 hospitals that are a part of that corporation, and they have just about 250,000 employees. So um, to tie this back with the question asked earlier, uh, we will certainly sign up any size of employer as an affiliate organization. Our ability to offer that deeper discount uh, was in part influenced by the fact that there's such a large pool of employees to draw from in an organization like the Hospital Corporation of America. 
So uh, that's a great question. It is quite a large organization, uh, which certainly helps in the types of things we can do with an organization. Great. What does the formal partnership agreement process look like? Um, well, it's actually quite simple and streamlined. The base level partnership is um, established through something called an um, affiliate agreement form. And essentially, um, you can email outreach at csuglobal.edu, and I will be able to send you that form along with some other relevant information about CSU Global. You essentially check your preferences on that form, send it back to me. I will get an okay from uh, Mr. Travis here, and uh, we'll get that form signed and entered into our systems. Essentially, I enter uh, your company's information into uh, systems that are visible both by our, our enrollment department as well as our financial teams. So that when a student from your company uh, enters uh, into the enrollment process, they will have to you know, identify themselves uh, to our enrollment counselors as being employed by you. Um, and the enrollment counselors and the financial teams will be able to confirm that, that we are indeed partnered with your organization. And then from there, they'll be able to get that discount applied. Now, um, that typically takes about a week or so to, to complete. So it's really, really quick and um, very streamlined process for that base level partnership. Um, regarding deeper level partnership, depending on what benefits you would like to take advantage of, uh, we take that on a case by case basis. So uh, we'll, we'll communicate very closely, uh, make sure that um, you know, if we have, we have a, some phone calls, maybe some uh, video chat meetings, just so we can truly understand what you're looking to accomplish. And then we'll work through the appropriate processes to either look at your training, develop custom curriculum, post your jobs. Uh, but really here at CSU Global, we move very quickly. So um, things tend to go as quickly as you, <laughs> as quickly as you uh, push them. Thank you. So you mentioned that it takes about, um, generally speaking, a week for the process um, to, you know, sort of agree um, to the partnership. Uh, so with that, how long or how soon can employees start using the benefit? Uh, yes. So essentially, once a, an employer becomes a partner, um, the, the student's next term, next billing rate will be updated, essentially. They do have to self-identify. So if they're a brand new student and the agreement is signed before they begin, we'll go ahead and make sure that that discount is applied right away for their first term. If somebody's in the middle of a class and we sign the agreement, their very next term will be discounted, unless of course there are some extenuating circumstances. But for the most part, it's just the very next term uh, next billing term, we'll go ahead and get that updated for them. So uh, we have, I should mention this, we have 12 start dates per year. So um, you know, essentially, we can get that discount applied as soon as that next term comes up. Great. Okay, next question. My organization is a membership organization where other organizations become members of our organization similar to a chamber of commerce. If we are employer partners with CSU Global, are those organizations eligible for the employer tuition discount since they are members of ours? And how does that work? Yes, they are. So what, I guess ultimately, let me back up. Yes, they can be. And that really depends on you and how you choose to define who is covered by your organization. So we have many umbrella organizations um, where we will offer the discounts to employees directly of that organization and also to members of the organization as well. Uh, in those cases, we would just ask that you provide a list of all of the members, uh, member organizations, because generally, um, you know, even with going back to Hospital Corp of America, 
uh, an employee might not think of themselves as being part of the Hospital Corporation of America. They probably think of themselves as being an employee of St. Joseph's Hospital. So in the case of a membership organization, we want to make sure we're listing each individual organization as part of that um, umbrella organization. Great. My organization has over f um, 150,000 employees. Wow, that's a large organization. Is there a maximum employee limit? Um, there is not. So uh, we welcome large corporations uh, with uh, high numbers of employees. So that's perfectly fine. Uh, we will gladly extend uh, the partnership benefits to uh, all of those employees. Yeah, and, and I'll add to that, that in order to do a deeper level partnership, we don't require a certain number of employees in order to do that. Um, as Stan mentioned, we take those on a case-by-case -case basis. So please do email us at outreach at csuglobal.edu. We'll want to learn more about your organization and some of the training needs that you have for your employees. And we can talk about those opportunities to do a more significant tuition discount or to review the training that you're already doing to allow for college credit for your employees. Um, we have some examples where we've done special partnerships for small organizations uh, or small school districts because it is part of our mission to serve the state of Colorado uh, and workforce in the United States in general. So, uh, we are certainly open to having those conversations and we'll take each one of those on a case-by-case -case basis. Wonderful. And this is our final question. Uh, does CSU Global attend employer partner company picnics and other company events um, if that is requested by the organization? Yes, to the best of our ability, we'd be happy to participate in uh, employer events. Um, we do often send representatives to um, education fairs, uh, to um, employer events. Uh, so yes, in short, we do uh, have the ability to send uh, our representatives to those types of both community and uh, employer events. Yes, and uh, I, would, I would add that we are part of a few consortiums here in both the Denver Metro and Colorado Springs areas. So if you're a local business and interested in having more than one university attend, we can help set that up um, because we are part of these groups of schools that can set up a, a fair for your particular organization. Um, that's one offering. And then in addition, we have enrollment representatives located throughout the United States. So we can certainly accommodate being at employer fairs or other event opportunities um, across the U.S. Um, when, when possible. Wonderful. A big thank you to Travis and Stan for your time and the information you shared with us today. Thank you to all of our viewers for joining us. We hope you found the conversation informative and useful. On behalf of everyone at Colorado State University Global, thank you and have a great rest of the day.